Okay, guys, this video is understanding your liquidation price or understanding your liquidation points or liquidation stuff in general. As you can see on this screen, this is the price I got into trade position, which is just a screenshot of one of my sample trade I took a few days back. And as you can see, about 35% profit is, is being made. Um, 35, 35, 35, 35% $35 made, $100 used as you can see here. This is the amount that was used in dollars. This is the size in BTC. This is the point I got into trade, which is 6875. That is when I entered. And my liquidation point is 764, which is about um, $800 difference, which is not huge if it's a long term. It's a short position. I am shorting the market. As you can see, that's why I'm showing you red here. Yeah. And if I was going for a long term position, I'm explaining this video because of the long termers. For the short termers, we don't care about the equation point because we are using what? Stop loss. Please stick with the stop loss rule and watch the video. Accept, understand the stop loss process and please use it whenever you are trading. Now, for us who want to take long term option, when you want to take a long term option, don't use 20x. This is because I am doing a day trading term. I can use 30, I can use 40x. But when you are starting, remember what I told us we need to keep leverage low, like 3x, 5x. It's okay for beginners. Please do it step by step. It's progressive. Now, I got into trade as 6875, right? 0. 0.68. And my liquidation point is 764, which isn't bad. Uh, just a day trade stuff. But if you want to go for a long term, you're not going to use 20x, you're going to use like 3x or 5x. And the reason is because when you long, let's say you long when Bitcoin was say 6875 as it is here, then it start going up, start going up and went as high as um, maybe $8,000. But before it got to that $8,000, there will be some ups and downs. The market will go down because you have long, you've done the long in that okay. The next two, three, four months you have to take your profit. Definitely the market must have rose high before that within that very period you can take good profit or you can leave it till the next year, like I explained in the material. Okay, so if you are doing that, you have to use a low leverage. Now, this liquidation point, this liquidation point means that once the market hits that very price. This very price I've seen here, 764. You are going to lose everything in your account because you are using cross margin. Cross margin means that anything in your wallet, you lost everything. So, for example, if I if I was to long a market, I want to make sure that my liquidation, if it's a long term, for example, if I long when market was about 7,000, I want to make sure that my liquidation is showing me something around 4,500. You get a check now, 4,500. You see, the market can never fall all the way from 7,000 down to 4,500. Even if it ever does, it will take longer time. But after the halving, it is not possible. In the sh I'm talking of after the halving, within this period of time, within now to probably um october november it's not going to fall down to that trend if it's going to fall we're going to see it graphically and i'm going to tell everybody hey guys the market is going to dip and it's going to look huge you'll be notified but meanwhile that is the range it should be it should be something really far like three thousand four thousand dollar difference okay it is good so that even if the market goes down before it starts climbing up you don't need to bother you can leave your your position as long as you wish so when a new height is attained you can pull out your profits okay and if we see that the market is going to drop after the new height it will also signify that there's an incoming downtrend but the market is still going up and once it gets to a new height you need to pull out and maybe later take a new position again but most my advice is when you take your position like when i announce guys take your long position just take it and forget it. That is it. You're gonna make decent profit. So if market should Bitcoin should move, say, um, ten percent or twenty percent, you're going to make times five, which is ten times five, which is say fifty, right? Twenty percent times five, 
100. So something like that is what I'm talking about here. So if we can actually get this done, if you understand this concept of liquidation, you have to use a very low leverage to have a very large liquidation point. You are on point. So if you take your position, please check your liquidation point to know if it is safe or not. So to wrap up this video, the long-term position can give us as much as a thousand to five thousand percent return on investment within this same year or 2021, where a new all-time high of crypto or Bitcoin may have been attained. So let's take note of that. And when you want to you take this long position, the formula I have been explained in my 2020 um, gold mine wealth ebook. So we can go back to the ebook and follow what is there. Just use about 3x to 5x leverage maximum. Then use about 50% to 70% of what you have in your futures wallet and then leave it. The, little, the lesser you use it, the safer to my recommendation, but it's your choice. Now, when would I take this trade position? That's the interesting part. So do well to follow me. Save my number, my WhatsApp number. Follow my updates. I will always update us on this. So save my WhatsApp number and do that. Also, um, follow me on Facebook and my YouTube. I'll be sharing this information. Uh, when market is about to go bullish, we cannot take the trade position and leave it for a very long time. So thank you very much for watching. See you inside. Bye-bye.